On the scene, on the story, this is News 9. The Oklahoma County Sheriff has hired a new employee to take a bite out of crime, if you will. The jail now has a full-time contraband sniffing canine. News 9 crime tracker Jennifer Pierce is at the county jail. She caught up with the newest deputy hard at work. Jen? Kelly, the newest Oklahoma County deputy is Han the K-9. He's been on the job for a month now, and he's already making an impact inside the jail. He's new, and he's a go-getter. As you can see, he loves working. Meet Han, Oklahoma County Jail's contraband sniffing canine. Sergeant Curtis Whittington, his handler, is proud to have the year-and-a-half-old German Shepherd as his sidekick. You know, I've had several inmates say they see us coming in, they start flushing. Flushing drugs and anything that may be illegal behind bars. Jail officials say the need for a full-time jail canine is essential for safety. It'll make this a safer facility. It'll be safer for the employees. It'll be safer for the inmates. An Oklahoma City law firm donated the funds to purchase and train Han after hearing how he could save the county money. A canine can complete a search of a jail cell with accuracy and in a fraction of the time it can take multiple detention officers. Well, we had no idea really of the amount of manpower that is expended every day by the sheriff's department uh, that a dog can cut down dramatically, not only from a cost standpoint, but just the number of people that are needed. Han is trained to sniff out drugs and anything that may smell like narcotics. Soon he'll be certified to find cell phones and chargers. This hardworking canine has already found contraband, and word of his presence is spreading fast. They don't want to get caught with, with whatever contraband they have, so we're, we're already making an impact. Jail officials say the four-legged officer will also help cut down on drug-related fights, assaults, and overdoses. We're live on the scene on the story in downtown Oklahoma City. Jennifer Pierce, News 9. All right, Jim, we appreciate it.